No, they're not mad. They're fine. Everything's fine. I think we're back. I told you guys we were coming back with Friday the motherfucking 13th. This is what we're, this was happening. Here, here you. Fucking hot. Yeah, fuck yeah. I've been itching. Knock, I've been itching. Get to those tips. Knock your socks off. Fuck yeah. Nope. 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 Game's a little buggy. <laughs> Hold is that, on. Is that plugged in properly? No. Try it again. Nope. Let's see if that does it. Oh, hey, there we go. There we All go. Right. All right, great. Game's a lot buggy. Huh? Game's a lot buggy. Game's a lot buggy. Oh yeah, we gotta get we gotta get my perks up here. This is is this you? Yeah, this is you. Yeah, this is my perks. Yeah, I don't have some of these. Okay, let's see what you got here. Oh, I like this. Generate less noise while sprinting. I, I did get the epic. My dad's a cop. Look at that one. Oh yeah, if you're the one to call the cops. Look at look at it. Twenty nine. They get there in like three faster. odd minutes. Ooh, that's great. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's a great perk. Silent D I S. Silent Dis. I guess Silent sure. Dis says, "Hey Jack. Hey Rich. Hi. The original Tron is thirty-five years old today. As flaw as it was, as flaw as as it was, it hit all. It hit it at the right time, I think, to make me love it sure. and make an impression. Thoughts." I have the same, pretty much. Yeah. I have a soft spot for Tron. I can admit it's not a great movie, and it's, <laughs> it's largely saved by Jeff Bridges being Jeff Bridges. Well, but not just that. Like, the spectacle, the look, it's so different. It's a weird case of, like, a, a Hollywood spectacle film uh -huh. being made for all the right reasons. <laughs> yes. Yes, yes. Ooh. Passionate, passionate people. Like, we can do all this, all this neat computer animated stuff. Yeah. Rather than we can cash in and do all this computer animated stuff. Wait, sell that. I got those two in the house ones. Oh, yeah. Sell one of those. Sell the 15 one. Sell the 15? Yeah, not the 19. Yeah. Yeah, roll some new ones. Roll some new ones. See? Ooh, sure. Roll the dice. See what we get. All right. Let's see if I'm lucky. Medic? Yeah, I got him. Decent oh, medic. Oh, 5%. Boo. Boo, medic. Sell. Try it again. Try it again. Come on. No, 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 no. Potent Ranger. Oh, it's... that's just a Tommy one. That's a weak. Well, if you're going for a kill. Yeah, but you already have it. You have a better one. Yeah. That was a weak one. One more roll. One more roll. Two, really? Well. Unless we get an epic. Oh. oh, well, better than what you get. Oh, well, your sprint speed is decreased. What do you think? It's 2% is nothing. Sprint speed's, speed's nothing. It's all about stamina. Get okay. rid of that. All right, one more. One more roll. One more roll. Who's the big winner? Who's the big winner? No whammy, no whammy, no whammy, no whammy. Sneaky. Oh. No one likes that one. You move. The sneaky is you move through a window faster. <sighs> No one cares about you, Sneaky. Get out of town. All right, we can't afford another one. All right, that's fine. All right, so wait, where was I? What, what perks did I get for the, you? The Tron sequel? I think the Tron sequel, Tron Legacy, is it's perfectly adequate. Uh, again. Perfectly adequate. Much like the original Tron, not a great movie, <laughs> but it looks great. The soundtrack is great, and it's all right. But better than the original, I think. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Like, like just like... As a general movie. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Absolutely. It's perfectly fine. Less noise while sprinting. Increase melee stun time with bats. Once again, uh, another Tron film that is largely saved by Jeff Bridges. <laughs> 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 right? C.S. Chamb, or Kusk Chamb, however you want that pronounced, says, Thanks for the hours of distraction. You're welcome. Pretty good. And J Fresk Two says, "Jack, did you read the Vision miniseries? I finished it today. It was amazing. The one where he starts his uh, family. That's all they say. They say the Vision miniseries. I have no idea what that refers to. 
there there was a there was a small a vision run <clears throat> where he decides he wants his own family and unfortunately the end of it was spoiled for me by the champions which i read first and so if it, you know i've been thinking about it okay it's supposed to be very good it's supposed to be very good um also, question for both of you. Yeah. What is a typical day at ROM like? Start time, lunch, closing time, schedules, etc., etc. Oh, nine to five, paperwork all day. It, 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 there's no, there's no start time or schedule because it depends upon what what <laughs> needs to be done. Right. Like a a week where I need to build a planketo board is is very different. From like a week where I need to clean the studio, and mm. uh, we had an episode on Tuesday, and <laughs> I really need to screen some tapes. Yep. It, it it what it's what what's next? What do we need to do next? And I'm, I, I you know, up. Always, uh, I wonder if push. check check push to talk. Yeah, make I'm sure sorry. that's not on. Yo, can the orange there man shut the fuck up? Okay, now we're not. <laughs> like, like when the when the Canadians were in, it was a, a number of ten or so hour <laughs> days in a row. Right. You know who I've been really liking lately? Part eight. I, I have no kills set for him. I noticed that. Shit, Rich. Oh fuck. Couldn't get his kill set up in time. I'm sorry. Hopefully it won't be you. Quipley says, Yeah. The reason they don't add new character in Marvel is because they don't want to pay writers royalties for new IPs. Oh, sure. So they recycle the old ones. <laughs> that's, yeah. That's a, that's not a bad that's not a bad thought. That's, that's why Tom Paris in Voyager was Tom Paris and not like that one cadet who got jailed in the uh, <laughs> oh, Starfleet okay. Academy Wesley episode. Played by the same actor. So much oh, sure. It was going to be that character. We saw that once in TNG, but they did not want to pay the writer of that one episode royalties for Voyager. Really? Yeah. Let's kill Jason. Actually, let's escape. Oh, I love it when there's a kid playing. Did anyone else get away? Yeah, oh, they have a lot of fun, the kids. Oh, man, I'm right at Tommy Jar. Oh, but I'm right by the car. Shit. I have one guy pissed me off. There was a kid playing, and, you know, he was a kid, but... He wasn't unreasonable. The kid? He was, you know, helping people do stuff. Oh, okay. And this one guy found him annoying, so he shot him in the back. I was spectating, I watched it. A number of people were watching it. It was, it was a nice kid that, that got shot. This and when the match was over, help. I Jason told him, if you don't us. fucking leave this lobby, I, I, I guarantee alive. you there's going to be a Please posse help. hunting your ass down. <laughs> and yeah. he left. Oh, good. What a dick. You know, we're all just here to have fun, man. We're all just here to have fun. There we go. All right, oh, all right. I, I called Tommy. Now we gotta start searching. I didn't lock the doors. I didn't search the house yet because I I, I wanted to call Tommy in just in case Jason cut the power. I wanted to get that done right away. I'm sure Jason is close because the car is near. Bat, nice. Pocket knife, nice! Killing it. Horton hears you, says, hey Jack. Hi! Don't know if anyone has asked this recently. Fuck yeah, walkie talkie. But what are your thoughts on Childish Gambino's most recent album? Also, what are your thoughts on his music as a whole? Keep killing Nazis, Rich. <laughs> um... Childish Gambino is the actor um, Donald Glover. Yeah. If I, you know, it's so funny. I was just talking to my wife about Donald Glover. I was like, oh, Donald Glover is in this. He plays he plays the character that's the Prowler. Yeah. Who is special because the Prowler is the uncle to Miles Morales. And so if they ever... Or if you're an old school fan, he's just special because he's the Prowler. Exactly. Well, <laughs> it, well... No, we well we were talking about like where this movie where this movie could go in the future. 
like, oh, you know, Marvel gets Spider-Man back, right? And they're saying spoilers. That's more of an Easter egg, though. Oh, th oh, that's been all over the news. That's been all over. Yeah. It's 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 borderline. It's borderline. But it doesn't. That Donald Glover was in the that's, movie. That's nothing that will ruin the movie. Come on, guys. Shit, where is he? Who is the prowler? A old Spidey villain slash ally. Yeah. It's like a super criminal thief who you turned good. Jason, are you close by? Go get the guy in the boat. Get in the house. Look at these people. They're selling. They're selling out the the boat people right away. Yeah. They're doing what they want. Well, what they can do to stay alive. It's dick move, but yeah. it doesn't bother me. It's full fully within oh, yeah. what what the game was intended to be. That kind of selling each other out. Did they get out? Uh, they they won't. got out. They won't. So like I'm explaining to my wife who okay. Donald Glover is, and I'm I'm like I'm like oh Donald Glover you know he's on uh, he's on that show Atlanta and she's like oh I haven't seen that and I was like did you see Community? She's like no I didn't, didn't see, see Community I was like The Martian he's in The Martian. She's like oh, I don't remember that character from The Martian. And I was like he's uh did you ever watch the, the YouTube the sketch comedy show Mystery Team? No. I was like, oh, well, he's in it. Anyway, a lot of people know who he is. He's in it, blah, blah, blah. Oh, you know, he's also Childish Gambino. And she's like, oh, I know Childish Gambino. I was like, oh, well, fuck. Like, he, Childish Gambino, who is, you know, okay. like, indie hip-hop r and B. It's like, how do you know Childish Gambino? Uh, his new album is good. I enjoy it. It's, it's more soul than rap. And uh, I enjoy it a lot. I actually, you know, way back in the day... I was visiting my cousin in Los Angeles, and I had an opportunity to go to, like, a super okay, let's run underground hide. Childish Gambino show that he was working on for his, like, second album or something. Shit, where is he? Yeah, I don't know. Where is he? Don't worry about it. Just guys, somewhere on the other side of that railing. Uh, Where's the keys? The railing. Let's head to these guys. Quick. Oh, no. What? <laughs> Someone here has to have the damn keys. Right? They came to the car. One shot? Wait for us. <laughs> One shot? <laughs> oh, Jack. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was going to hit it with my baseball bat. You one Jack, shot killed me? Jack, Jack, for you, if you missed it, Jack was sneaking up behind Jason to hit him up with the baseball bat, and one of the counselors shot at Jason. But because Jack was standing right behind Jason, Jack got killed by the shotgun blast. Son of a birch. Well, at least I'm Tommy Jones. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. I dug up his body. It was the kid as well. Yeah, but I don't think it was intentional. No, no, they shot it. They did shoot Jason, too. Yeah. Ay, ay, ay. So in any case, I actually had a I had the opportunity to see him live. Uh, a friend of mine who was working at a talent agency at the time, um, I was staying at his house in Los Angeles back in the day, and he's like, "Hey, we're gonna we're all gonna go to the show. Uh, Donald Glover, uh, you know, he's he's trying out this new rapper thing, Childish Gambino. Do you want to see?" And I said, "Ah, you know, I've been it's been a long day." You run towards Jason, and your stamina is falling. And you know what? I'm just realizing there's no other people there. I thought I'd go and help people. Is the car leaving? Why is he standing there? The car's gone. Where? The car's gone. Can anybody hear me? So what is Jason up to? The controller's not working, man. Fuck. Where? Shoot him in the back. Huh? Shoot him in the back. Oh. Oh, what is Jason doing? Oh, now he's awake. Now he's awake. Hold on. I'm just gonna wait right here. And shoot Jason in the fucking back. <laughs> Bye, sucker! Yo, I my controller's <laughs> kind of a waste, but oh so funny. Is that your corpse? A person? I had a baseball bat. Where's my baseball bat? Somebody else probably grabbed it. They fucking took my baseball bat, Rich. Yeah, they, they shot you and stole your they baseball st bat. <laughs> they shot me and stole my shit. <sighs> oh. oh, 
But in any case, uh, I, I had the opportunity to see his show. I decided I was tired and didn't care because I hadn't heard of him at that point. Um, and I slightly regret it, but yeah, I guess not really because apparently his early shows weren't that good. But his new album's pretty good. His new album's pretty good. If you're into kind of indie hip-hop, R&B, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty good. The cops aren't called. The car and the boat are gone. We are so fucked. And the boat? Yeah, the boat's gone, remember? We saw the boat leave. So we need the phone. So Jason only has one objective to, to guard. And we, um... Hold up. I'm pretty hey, sure that... Boy, boy. Charge. Charge, get back up to Tommy. Charge, what's up? What did they say? Sorry, uh, he's sorry. You're sorry for shooting. Right? Oh, yeah. I'm terribly follow sorry. Us. Charge. Follow, follow us. Oh, they think they're, they think they're doing the phone. Follow them. Okay. You have you have a good repair stat. Tommy has like the best repair oh. stat, the best speed. Oh great! They probably want you to fix the phone. The guy who killed you. Yes, but it was an accident. It was an accident. He didn't purpose. Like, he wasn't being a dick about it. The phone's not in here. Come on. Okay. Do you want to ask them questions? We're yeah. just going to wait here until the hit time runs out. Hey, do you guys have the fuse? No. I think we should go look for that. Yeah, let's go look for the fuse. You should check the shore. Somebody probably left with a, with a car. It might wash up on the shore. What? Is that what it does? Yeah, that's what happens. Dude, I think we should go help him. I think we should go help him. Okay, okay, I'll bring spray. Come on, y'all. There we go. At least you go find the fuse box. I don't know. Well, yeah, that's what we're doing. We're gonna go find the fuse box. See if we can find that fuse. Check the houses. He's in rage. Um, but you know, uh. The, the new Challenger Scambino record recently came out, but I don't care about it as much as I care about Chance the Rapper's Coloring Book mixtape, which has been the only thing playing in my house for the past three days. I know that's, like, that's an old, you know, that's old at this point, but I am obsessed with it. What a great fucking, I mean, it's, it's, it's essentially an album, and it's great. Look at all the drawers. Have a map in there if you need it. Okay. Everybody have a map, right? Tommy don't need no map. Let me do this. I have, I have Next house. All right. All right. Yeah. It looks like these houses Fr have been out. Friday the 13-year-old. <laughs> that's fair. That's, that's fun here. comment. Yeah, yeah. I like that. Bye. Hey, my controller's fucked up. You guys can kill me if you want. I can't even do shit. How do we kill it? I don't know. Just attack me. I can only go left. Oh, wait. I can now see. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. My controller's working. <laughs> I gotta try and fucking do. PC. <laughs> PC. Why are you asking? This is a cross platform. This isn't cross platform. It would be great if it was cross platform. More bodies. That's more on Sony and Microsoft than it is on just about anything else. Sure. That other door's probably unlocked. Yeah, Not that it matters with this Jason. Oh, yeah. This, uh, Jason. this is wreck everything shit, Jason. If he found it. It's probably in that last house. Damn it! Oh, it was right there. That's the generator. That's not the phone. Oh, oh well, it needs to be up for the phone to work, right? N I don't think so, but fix it. Where's the phone house? This way. This way. It's probably in the house. Follow. Yeah. That's it. Oh, yep, there it is. Cover me. Cover me, okay? Stop. We got your back. 
Jason's busy. He's over there. Oh, she's in the trap. Oh, nice. I'm gonna call the police. I got, I got, uh... He's got the perk. Let him do it. Oh, yeah. I'm just keeping an eye on Jason. Oh, you hey. guard that box. Huh? You guard that box so he doesn't smash it. I also just don't want him to see me and come over here. We're the kids at Camp Crystal Lake. He's killing us. He's killing everyone. He's gonna. Please no. help. Yeah, does he see me? Look at him back there. Does he see me? His controller might be broke again. I kind of want to hit him with my bat again. Go, save him. Go, go, save him. Go. Hey, stay away. Aw. Better hit roll. I need a new weapon. My bat's gonna break. Flashlight's a dead giveaway? Nah. It's not. If Jason sees you, he's using sense anyway. And the flashlight is I irrelevant. It's better to have it on to keep your fear down. Yeah, you don't want your fear to build up. Then you lose your map, you lose your, your items. Especially if he kind of knows where you are in the first place. Just, just by the way Jason plays, it, it, it's it's a good, it's a good call to have it on. There you go, for that. There you go. What? I don't know. Okay, like I want to hit him, but I'm not sure if he's just fucking with us. Denied. Come on. Is the other guy done? No, they're. Oh, they're. They're. Where are they going? They're gonna wait by the one exit for three minutes. Which that's, is, a, that's a bad idea. The, the, it's not. It's not for you to say. It's not for you to say. What's your stamina? I'm just, I'm J Listen, Jason just teleported I know, somewhere. I know. No one's there. No one's here. Hit him. Knock him down. Jason! Come and get me! <laughs> Bye, remember. dickhead. This game is fun. This game is always. This game is fun. This game is super fun. Great Hand Christ says, Jack, have you ever read The Max? Started as a quirky 90s image comic and ended up as an existential art comic. Sam Keith wrote and drew it. It was brilliant. No, you know, I've never read The Max. Rich, have you read The Max? It was trippy. I didn't hate it. I liked the the character. The, he had the big teeth, right? The yeah, I'm unclear if that was teeth or a mask. Oh, Why they sure. Hiding in the garage that literally has no door. We're gonna circle around the house, Jason. That's what we're gonna do. Hey, charge, charge! I have a, I have a radio. Charge! Get back to base. <laughs> what do you say? Get back to base. Get back to base? And uh, still make them know where you are. And uh, we'll tell you where. Actually, come back to camp. Come back to camp. At one time. 50 seconds, okay? You have to get back to camp. This kid's adorable. Okay, dark? I know. I know. Now you have a radio. Uh, ready? Hit T. Uh, I have a radio. I'm making Jason circle. Maybe Jason wants to go hey, check uh, them out because I was done. causing him too much hassle, or maybe his controller broke again. Okay. I'm the you know what? Three health potions. Sure. sure. Why not? Uh, Funk Rocket says, Rich, have you seen Star Trek The Motion Picture Director's Cut that came out years back? Robert Wise re edited the film and added minor SFX that wasn't there before due to time constraints. It's great. Yeah, I have that. I'm pretty sure I have that version. Okay. What's their 
Uh, off the top of my head, I don't even remember what, what is different about that and the theatrical, like, specifically. Or where to show up? Right, go, by, right by them. Go, 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 go. Get over here now. Run. All right, thank you. Cool. I got a wrench. Not. Fuck. That's good. He's on you, not them. You're, you're being a good Tommy. Yep. Alright, he's. Oh, he's all fucked up. Yeah, his, his controller's super broken. They're waiting for me. I know, they're nice. Oh, what well, great. Hi. Go. Go, 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 go. Aw. That's great. Good game. Everybody good job. Good game. You guys are good. <laughs> did you hear that? Good game. We did it. Wow, that's Jason. I, oh. you guys. I think Jason was having controller issues. Yeah, and that did happen at, at one time. Come to it mommy. totally fucked up. <laughs> oh. Or Come Jason might mommy. be on some sort of medication. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Everybody, everybody escaped. Oh. Team escaped. Well, even except for me. Shots. Well, by the way, Jason didn't even kill me. Someone else killed I know, me. I know. I know. <laughs> What are your thoughts on Run the Jewels 3? It's one of my favorites. Uh, Run the, I mean, listen, Run the Jewels is amazing. 3 is good. I personally prefer 2. Run the Jewels 2 is way more hype. Uh, I was really excited, you know, off of uh, the Black Panther trailer featured a Run the Jewels song in there. It's awesome. Run the Jewels 3 is alright, but I felt like 3 is a little angrier and a little darker. 2 is just straight up hype. And uh, so my my favorite, I would go two one three for Run the Jewels. Is is how I go. <clears throat> Huff Hearted says, "Hey again." Mm. Hearing Rich talk about high scores and kids these days, I think the high score has been replaced by the speed run time. Mm. What's your thoughts about speed running old games? I, I'd say you're probably right. Speed running times is the equivalent of the old school high high score. Um, I I I enjoy watching some speed runs. It depends. Sure. Uh, I've I've seen speed runs of like Yoshi's Island, which involves being extremely good at the game, mm -hmm. and then I've seen speed runs of Dark Souls, which is all about glitching out of the map and running past ninety percent of the game. Right. That's somewhat less interesting to watch. Like I get it. We found an exploit, and this is how we can be the speedrun. But it's like, I would much rather just see someone uh, nah, yeah, do play the game super fast. Yeah. The game, the game. You know. I'm not even sure how to do that, to be honest. Every black movie show trailer is using one the jewels. Yeah, that's probably true. Listen, I mean, they're, they're just a fucking great group. A great group with some sick-ass beats. Ah, oh, shit. I so, saw um, somebody... Was that real? Uh, you know, you know uh, this can't be real. what a tool-assisted speedrun is? Tool-assisted speedrun? They, no. they use, like, emulators and programs to, like, plan out the button input. So they're not actually playing the game. They program how the game gets played. They program out the button inputs ahead of time. Huh. And they can do things, like, you know, with much quicker reaction times than a human ever could. Sure. And it, it's guaranteed the game's going to play out the same way every time because of the way these things work. Uh... There was a tool-assisted speedrun where using the same button inputs for every game, somebody beat, well, the computer, they programmed the computer so it would beat Mega Man X1, X2, and X3 at the same time with the same button inputs for every game. What? I know, it was insane. Like that. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're here. That's one where I would, uh, like, I just want a documentary about how it was done. Like, I don't even <laughs> care about watching the game run, you know, like... <laughs> Just show me how you did that programming. <laughs> well, Jason doesn't have his sense yet, so he might not know I'm in the house. Door's still closed. He's close. Ah, good. Found somewhere else to go. 
nothing useful in this house. So that must mean the phone box isn't here. I haven't seen a phone. Usually, sometimes the phone's in this on this house. How many Nazis did Rich kill? I killed all of the Nazis, well, most of the Nazis in the first uh, mission act of uh, Wolfenstein 3D. Yep. Ah, it was great. All right. Well, great. Do I have a map? I don't have a map, so we'll go get a map. <gasps> Holy shit. Oh, so, oh, someone's dead already. Is that a dead body? Somebody was mad they didn't spawn as Jason, so they quit out, and their corpse is lying there. Dickhead. No, they had a weapon. Did they? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. It, you know. Well, somebody just died already. They're incompetent. <laughs> <laughs> no, that happens. Because they're incompetent, yes. Well. Sy <laughs> <clears throat> Sperling says, Yeah. Two men enter, one man leaves. Monty Python versus Kids in the Hall. Who lives and who dies? Monty Python lives. Kids in the Hall. Kids in the Hall die. Kids in the Hall live. Uh, I I like Kids in the Hall, but and you know, like if you know, that's just one of those like if you got to choose one, and of course we wouldn't have Kids in the Hall without Monty Python, um, because they've they've noted that like Monty Python were a huge influence on them. If we're if we're talking about theme song, I give that to Kids in the Hall. Well, Shadowy Men from a Shadowy Planet are just a great uh, surf rock band, absolutely. I, I I would much prefer. Oh, shit. Kids in the Hall. What is Kids in the Hall? That's a old sketch comedy show. Shit. Shit. That's fine. That was That's fine. fine. That was fine. That was fine. <laughs> you know, sometimes that works with a shotgun, uh, just to like quick, mm -hmm. uh, to quick draw like that. Uh, did not work out so. Ooh. Uh, no, I got it. Hit him through the. Nope. Not anymore. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck you. Oh my god, you did it. I must have the- do I have the grab perk? Are you- I got you, I got you, I got you. I got you. Whee! The car? This guy? Is that him, I can't hear him. Jason was starting to knock down the door, so I'm getting the fuck out of Dodge. <laughs> That's what I know. I don't care what they're talking about. Come on, give me my map back. And he's asking, he's saying, Chard, help, help us, Chard. Huh? And you're saying, I'll have none of that. No. <laughs> Sorry, sucker. <laughs> To be, to be fair, you're playing as uh, Bugsy. Bugsy with a G. Yeah. And he can't fix the car worse shit. He's kind of, he's kind of, you know, reliant on the help from strangers. Oh yeah. Bugsy. Oh hello, gas. You know you have to. Ah, you know you have to. I know I have to. I just hate giving up my weapon. Have. Oh sorry. Go ahead. Have gas on route to car right now. We got this. Stop tripping over your ass, bug. Are you Jason's at the car. Okay. Ivan Lee, I will not say that because Goldacott certainly did things wrong. Don't go in the trap. I'm already got a bunch of XP. Thank you. <laughs> I, I trap a the... sprung. Trap a sprung. Nobody has keys. Okay. 
Okay, hit you. All right, people, find the keys. Let's go. Got him that time. Uh, hey. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, hey. Dick. Uh, yes. There's a weapon in here. Yeah, there we go. You're the muscle. You're Bugsy. Uh, I know. Uh, Listen. The, you finding the keys is not your job. But your we, job is to keep Jason off of everyone else's back while they find you know the keys. The cops are called, so yes, I will help. Mid swing. Twice. Don't forget your bat, dude. He's swung at. Uh, <laughs> what are you doing, nerdly? <laughs> what are you doing? Steal the fucking bat! <laughs> You're the nerdly. <laughs> You're good. You're good. You got, got something. Everyone else dead already, or do they just flee? No, they f look, they ran- oh, well, Jason's over there, too. Nice, fucking ran away! <laughs> uh, took my fucking bat, and now I got a 2 by 4 like an asshole. <laughs> I was mid-swing when he grabbed me. Yeah, to be fair, you, you did steal her, uh, gun. No, when I gave her the gas, <laughs> and I used that gun to distract Jason. You're welcome. Is Jason in there? Yes, when it's a when it's a child playing, it is most definitely wrong to stare at her butt. You. Ah! Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, he had to die. Yes. Well, yeah. I mean, this is the third time he grabbed <laughs> me. That's fair. Me. That's fair. I was trying. I was trying to be the hero. <laughs> That's what I get for trying to be the hero. It's great. It's great. It was fine, Jack. You did your job. I did my you job. You did. You did your job. Oh, I knocked him out several times. You were a good bugsy. Mm-hmm. I've really grown to like playing as as the muscle. Like you know, yep. a lot of times I'll play as the stealthy quick fixer because I'm looking out for number yeah. one. Yeah. Oh yeah. But playing you need, as to be, the you need to be in a group though. Yeah. You need to be in a group. Well, you just got to find some other people and hang around. I've had some, I've had some fun escapes as, as the smart, stealthy one. Yeah. Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! I love. Oh. Run away! <laughs> Run away, little kid! No, no, no! She's building up her stamina. It's fine. Okay. It, 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 it might even be the smart move for that kid right now. Unless she swings at him. Uh, Alright, where are the cops gonna come? Because you're not gonna outrun the morph. Oh. Did he not notice her? I'm a string he went, he went straight for the cops. Yeah. Oh. Oh, and you're at the wrong exit. You're at the wrong exit, Tyrannosaurus Rex. <laughs> but you have the sweater. Interesting. Interesting. I, I love it when you're the smart person and you get the car together in like the first minute of the game. Who is that? Mm -hmm. God, I can't look. Sometimes. Sometimes that's nice. You walk into the first house you go into. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's the gas. Grab the gas. Sprint to the car. Jason's not even there yet. <laughs> One house later, you walk out. There's the battery. Sprint to the car. Get right. it in. Why did you raise my hopes for getting a half in the bag today? I, well, uh, I want to say the last two Sundays, I, I did say I Jay and Mike have last. released videos. Yeah, I fully expected it to be up. And I, I know the three of y'all saw Spider-Man on Friday because uh, I happened to be at the same showing. So I assumed. Kid, why are you not? Now is the time to sprint to the cops. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm getting a weapon, I guess. Kid's still talking. There's no one to coordinate with. That kid is still talking. He's a he's a let's player. He's right. a scamp. 
He's a he's, <laughs> he's a let's player. What are you doing? Is Jason letting you go? He might be too adored. It's, the kid is too adorable for Jason sure. to kill. Sure. So, I mean, and, you know, I just... Also, I know how long it takes Jay or Mike to edit an episode, and usually it just takes them a couple days, so... I am very surprised that we have not had an episode. I And, uh, so, and then thirdly, um, I was really expecting Jay just to push our buttons by pressing go live exactly when we started streaming. Yeah, yeah. So I was expecting Jay to be a bit of a, a dick about it. Really? 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 Wait, can you swim out? No. They apparently tried. How weird. How weird. I should have killed you. You really should have. Did I give them a stern talking to? Who? Time to come home now. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't edit half the video. They edited the, the, the skit was done. Okay. Sure. Not oh. a very complicated one in the first part, first place, but we filmed that ahead of time. Oh no, but I just you know like I know I've because I've seen movies with you guys before and like I just know okay. in general how long it takes. So like my guess is if it's not out today, it'll be out tomorrow. But we're talking about two movies. Oh, sure, yeah, then there's two movies. So. Still. But when did they film the other one? I would assume this would be a rush job, but... Yeah, absolutely. Just in case that kid's working with Jason, we're going to find a new lobby. That's fine. Just in case. Oh, you know what? Oh, he is adorable, but, you know, there's only so much he can take. It's just, you don't have to be mean, but, you know, we can move on. Find greener pastures. Yeah. Okay, oh. All right, we're gonna. Crane Hand Christ says, "I've seen things you people wouldn't believe." Wait. Flares on fire off the shoulder of Jason. A machete glimmer in the dark near Pakanak. All those moments will be lost in time, like tears from the rain. The one, the one good thing of Blade Runner, it, it was improvised. Anonymous says, as more men become stay-at-home dads, oh. the portion of praise to men has increased for doing the same things women have been doing thanklessly. When was the last time you thanked your partner? Thanklessly. Mother's Day has been a thing for ages. When did, since when have people not loved their mothers? I think um, I think what they're referring to. I, I don't think anyone doesn't love their mother or appreciate their significant other who stays home and watches the kids and cooks all the food, which is, by the way, me. Um, I think uh, in general, like they're talking about a, 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 like a general like, oh, you're just a stay at home mom. It's something like that, which which I have actually heard before in real life. Yeah. Someone like look down at stay at home parents who are just like, oh. I went into the... I never have! Huh? Oh, no, I never have either, but I have seen it firsthand. Um, no, and it's just like, listen, as long as you're contributing, if, if what you contribute to the household is is watching the kids and keeping a clean house, then boom, you're, you're good. That's all that matters is that you contribute. If you cook the meals and clean the house and watch the kids, that is your fucking job, and you do your job, you know? Don't don't uh, don't confuse like assholes with all of society. But I have I have seen it before. Ooh, hello, Tommy Jarvis. Tommy Jarvis, right there. Oh, the radio. Mike, that's a bit early. Hello, hello. Find the radio first time. Oh God, please. Oh God, help us. Jason's real. Please help us. <laughs> Congratulations on not getting interrupted by half in the bag. I'm, it's, it's more surprise than Fight relief. You, what? Uh, oh, I think it's great. I think it's great. Like whoever, like whoever uh, is willing to stay at home and deal with that shit, good for them. Because man, sometimes it is shit. Hello, fuse. 
Oh, I got a shit repair set. Oh, I have a map? Oh, yeah. Who just came in here? What are you doing? Oh, are you guys fighting? Yeah. Come on, man. Ah, uh, heal inspired. Oh, and a Jason. Nice. Jason's here. Hey, me and Tiffany are having a fight in here if you could not. Yeah, the fight drew them there. Oh, mid swing again. You know, you know that doesn't work unless unless there's a group to protect your back. I was I was mid swing. Shouldn't I be able to finish no. my fucking swing? No. Oh fuck. You need to gang up on Chase and try to take him on one on ones. So never I smart. I, could, I thought I could get one hit in. You have to. You might get lucky if it's like a bad Jason, but a good Jason, no, it's just gonna be grabbed. You're gone. Unless you got a pocket knife, then you can get. A, you can get a little bit bold if you have a pocket knife, because then you got to. Sure. You have a free out. Yeah. 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 All right. At least we got a nice door. Is someone else dead. Uh, Is Tommy there, basically? No, just me. All right, I'll wait to see if you're Tommy. Someone tell these kids in the game to go to bed. Yeah, <laughs> it is getting late. Have we ever thought about streaming Skyrim? Nope, nope, I haven't. Not even once. What are our thoughts on the newly released Spider-Man editor's cut? I can't imagine that an editor could save that movie. There. Which Spider-Man Spider 3? 3? Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't care. <clears throat> Spider-Man 3... 2 would at least be interesting because that movie is such a clusterfuck of it doesn't know what it is or what it's doing. Wait. Amazing 2? Amazing Spider-Man 2. Amazing 2. Right, there we go. I, th I thought that would have just been obvious. Spider-Man and two and clusterfuck. Well, that's yeah, why I yeah. got very confused because I was talking about the Raimi trilogy. You guys think that the Jason hitbox is a little broken? No, he has he has a what do they call it in fighting games? Like a null lock. Like you know his grab cancels out your swing, so you don't even get to finish your hey, you don't even get to finish your swing. Also, ping is a thing. Also, ping is a thing. Have I played Hollow Knight? No, but I do own it now. I gotta get out of here. Now. Okay. Oh yes, I think I'm right by my dead body too. So maybe Jason didn't put any traps. I think I was in this house. Oh, what's Jason up to? His ammo. No, he's by the archery range. I believe I died in this house. Maybe not. Okay, I died in the next house. It was one of these houses. So I know where the fuse is, so we got that going for us. So how do you get to be Tommy? <clears throat> um, it's... Oh, shit. It's random. Yeah, uh, once Tommy has been called... Via the radio, a dead counselor has a chance to come back as Tommy. The game usually waits until there are two dead people, and then one of them gets to be Tommy. Oh my god, what happened? Ooh, so where's the fuse? Where's the phone? Right, it's gotta be in one of these houses. It's usually fairly close. Uh, it might be that one back there. I don't think it usually is, though. I didn't see it, but worth a look as long as There's we're There's some here. houses up north that it can be at. Nope. No. All right, well, you know, we're in this cluster of houses, so I'll just check all around the camp. Where's Jason? Oh, you're way over there. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Maybe that house. So yeah, you have to radio in to Tommy, which you saw me do earlier, and then it chooses randomly from one of the dead or escaped campers. Yeah. You don't have to die. It could be an escaped camper. Usually it's a dead camper. Usually. Unless it was like an early escape. Right. Well, also that was like an early call. Like, Do you want a radio if anyone's seen the phone? Sure. 
Anybody seen the fuse box? I have the fuse. The fuse is at, uh, the and they're chasing. Bye. Okay, he's going to hunt someone else. And Tommy Jarvis runs for his life. Hey, this is my second chance. I'm not fucking it up. Or maybe I am. Real Rob Rose says, I went back and watched the last few times Len Kabazinski on Best of the Worst. Yeah. God bless whoever edit, whoever edits those and has to pod down his mic 100% of the time. Put? <laughs> Put down it. Yeah. 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 You are a miracle worker. No, he was, you know what? He was much better the second time. Yeah. That... Coming into a group dynamic like that, him never being on a show like this. Yeah. His his chatterness was perfectly acceptable. Like and and if you look at his second appearance, uh, it was it was much more restrained and he kind of got the flow a lot better. So can't blame anyone. He's not really that kind of performer, so. On phone. You found that cell. That's almost certainly not up here. Where am I? All right. One of the spots that can frequently spawn is the garage, but likely it's it's one of those two buildings north of you. Most likely. No, I've checked all four of those north. You checked north. all four of those? Yeah. Then it might be the one by the car, or it could be by the garage. Those are the free. Those are the frequent spots. Check the garage. I think I'm slightly closer to the garage. Double check these houses because fortunately then... Tommy can cover a good deal of ground. Oh yeah. Quickly. Tommy's a fast one. So no, Len was great. Len was great. Uh, yeah. Person in chat, we we already answered the Splinter Cell question like earlier, way earlier the stream. Yeah, yeah, I've played it. Rich, you haven't. Not not especially. It's linear. It's linear. It, it, the look, I've, like I haven't played it. It looked like linear. It is. To no, me. I have played it. It's linear. Like more like a puzzle stealth than. Here's how I'm going. To, here's how I am going to tackle this situation. Right. If I knock out that guard, I can get to there. But I, I never really played it, so I might be completely wrong. I don't know. I'm not saying it's the worst thing ever. Yeah, you might enjoy it. It's, it, had, it had its moments. Oh. You know what? It had its moments. Get your light on, Tommy. Who yeah, get your light on, Tommy. It was not by the garage. It is not by the garage. Yep, I made the wrong call, but you know what? It was a, it was a coin toss. So now we check the other houses. Not this guy, I don't see anything on this guy. Oh shit, Jason's right there. He's chasing someone else though. Slowly, so Jason doesn't find me. Crawl through the window. I got enough. I gotta keep. I gotta keep moving. We'll see. Yeah, you're on the other end of this building. Nope. Right. It's probably that building a person's by. Probably. If it hasn't been anywhere else. <laughs> Unless I missed it, which obviously is possible. Oh, wow. oh just the battery. Do you need gas, too? Yeah. Just, or I'm saying just the battery is installed. Hello? Nope. Nope. Oh, my God. That's like three. You're fighting part two, Jason, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's why, that's why part two, Jason, is cheap. Nope, that's what I wanted to drop. Let's see if I can find some fucking 
pocket knives or some health spray or some shit. Where did she take that battery? I don't know. Did she install it? Yeah, the battery's installed. We need gas and keys. I don't know. Somebody probably missed it. It's probably in one of these houses by the car. Why don't we search these houses? What? We'll, we'll be the guy that gets the car together. That'll be our that'll be our thing. Uh, <laughs> that'll be our shtick? Yeah. Sure. Well, then we'll search. Jason's on the prowl. Trap by that door. What? Like a counselor set a trap by the open door. Oh, did they? Oh, yeah, I didn't even notice. I would have totally been I know, trapped I know. by the mad trap strats. Gosh, darn it. Hey, is Jason chasing you? No, you're just in here. Well, what's in the little house? I don't know. Somebody must have just missed it. Yes? Yeah. Or they ran away with it. It's possible. Save that woman with your gun. Oh, Wait, he's in the... God damn it. Nice shot, Tommy. I thought, you know, Very I nice thought shot. I had him. I thought I had him. Celebrate, let's have a selfie. That was a nice selfie. Oh, that's a great one. That's two deaths. Zach Peterson says. Two <laughs> deaths. Jack. Yep. I play with inverted control. Yep. I have ever since GTA 3 on PS2. My f five-year-old son is starting to play Switch games. Should I force him to play non-inverted, or should I pass on my curse to him? What's wrong with inverted? There's nothing wrong with it. Uh, some games, Jack, are cheaply made. Um... Well, kind of like, kind of like, Friday, you know how Friday the Thirteenth doesn't let you rebind controls. Right. Some games don't let you invert. And really, it was occasionally a nightmare to me when I only played inverted. Oh. And I, I have not had any issues or regret since I switched over to non-inverted. Sure. Sure. Um. Yeah. Then don't pass on your curse. Let them. Let them. I think I let them the learn non-inverted. Yeah. Um, my kids play non-inverted. When like when they play Minecraft. Oh, yeah, that was the dumbest thing. Yeah, you did. I'm okay, so fucking dumb. Obviously. Who is that? Someone would say Minecraft. All right, get in, get in, get in. No. Get in. Yeah, yeah. Hit, hit. Uh, you have a chance because it's both Jason, but he's just gonna morph over to the exit. Time to get out of here. Oh, yeah, he's not that fast. I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, she's fucked. Oh. Jason's back in the water. Is that... No. That is not the exit. No. Yeah, you're kind of fucked, lady. Where are you... What are you doing? What are you doing? She's giving up. What are you doing? She's she's giving up. Why? That's not good. Because <laughs> Jason's in the water. Yeah, but look. She... What are you... <laughs> no one no one accused her of being smart. Yeah, I guess. Uh, so yeah. By the way, so l yeah, let your kids learn uninverted then. And you know what? That is usually the default in the game is uninverted. Uh, they won't know. They won't notice the difference. They won't I even know that inverted is a thing, unless you tell them. That it is, so. It's fine. There were some games, like Red Dead Redemption. I played, you know, played that back when I was playing Inverted. Yeah. Uh, it, it didn't invert the, the, the duels. Really? So when you had to reach for your gun, that was, it was normal for a second, then you had to kind of switch back up when it came time to aim. Sure, sure. There, I, there were constant nagging issues here and there with inverted controls. Okay. Dumbass! Double dumbass! What? I'm out of here. Oh my god. Some people. 
Some people. So might. close yet so far. Oh. She's got it. Okay. Oof. No, she doesn't have. Oh my! Double dumbass. What? The heck, lady? What are you doing? Can Jason get you on the boat? Yeah, it's actually really easy. If if Jason is anywhere near you, it's a button prompt to tip you out of the boat. You, you have a chance with part two because he's slow. Yeah. But a, a, a smart Jason player can get around that. Yeah. No, so he, it's a button prompt to tip you out of the boat, and then it's a second button prompt to drown you. It's it's a very easy kill Mom. if you are in the boat. Here's here's the thing. And the neck beard wins. The boat is great if Jason doesn't know what you're doing. Mm -hmm. When you fix the boat. Jason doesn't get a, a noise that lets him know the boat is fixed unless you fuck up when you're fixing the boat. Right. You can get out in the boat and Jason will never know what you're doing. Mm -hmm. But if Jason hears you fuck up when you're installing that propeller, mm -hmm. or if he notices you're leaving, he knows somebody's run over towards that boat, he can kill you super easy in the water if he knows you're getting out with the boat. The car, it's the other way around. The car... Uh, the second you start the engine, Jason gets an alert. He gets the, he gets to hear that engine start noise wherever he is on the map. He knows somebody has started a car. Mm -hmm. But you have a fighting chance in the car. It's not an instant kill when he stops the car. Yeah, that's fair. That's the balance. That's the difference. It's not the same thing, but it's one so looks like a boat, one looks like a car. But it's the same thing. It's not the same. Yes. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're two very different things, but they're—I they're, mean—they're just vehicles. There are a lot of great things about this game. There's also a lot of uh, negative things about this game. But I think the great things about this game outweigh the negative things. Nobody ever plays of the nerd because his stats are horrible. Yeah, you, there's there's people with good repair that also have decent stealth. There is no reason do. to use um, what's his name, Lachapa, the the fat nerd yeah. over Deborah. None. Is, his ma his major advantage first, like, is repair teleport, speed. Is repair go, smart? He's smart. Yeah. He fixes things good. Yeah. Deborah has that Back exact that same. She fixes things good. But she doesn't have the horrible, crippling, bad stamina yeah. that the fat nerd guy does. Exactly. Deborah's got the repair and the stamina. There's no reason you wouldn't rather have Deborah. Yep. You, ta you toss some uh, stealth stuff on Deborah, you're good to go. That's what I usually do. I think she even has decent stealth. She does have decent stealth. I toss extra stealth stuff on her, and that's, that's, my, us that's my usual go-to solo play. Like, if I don't think I'm going to be working with a group, mm -hmm. I'll go Deborah. Nasty guys. This one friend of mine's name's Duster. He fixes things yeah, me, well, he's, Rich. He's That's me. why you're a La Chapa. Gotta sharpen your skills. Her name was Deborah. <laughs> Remember that song? That Beck no. song? From, uh, oh, wait. I think I do. From Midnight Vultures, really I think. She said her name Good was luck, Deborah. Everybody. And a sister to Go to bed. It was, it was a it was a song about a menage a trois. Oh, Ooh, this might be me. That'd be fun. Yeah! Yay! I get to murder. Sometimes nice. You get a little, a little there, murder Jason. break. Pick up the two knives, even though you know what? I just never revenge. use knives. Oh, it's nice to get the murder break, but Ultimately, winning as a counselor is more satisfying. Uh, I will absolutely agree with you. Just a just a friendly little murder break. Hey, I'm here by the phone. No one's locked this door yet, so I'll knock it down. <laughs> That's a mad strat right there. Where is Glowing Eyed Jason from? Uh, he was a backer exclusive for this game. Deve uh, designed by Tom Savini. Yeah exclusively for this game. It's supposed to be Jason after he escapes from hell. That's why he's glowing with he's, he's glowing with the fires of hell it's burning embers. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah, it's, it's hellfire Jason. Sure, I get it. Crap. And with a hellfire blackened mask. Crap. Anyone, oh, 
Oh, someone's in the house. Oh, 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 oh! Peaches and cream. Oh, oh God! You make a grown man scream. You got that? All right, I'll just meet you out there. That's cool. Oh. Working on the car. Sons of bitches. I put some fucking traps there. They can't be working on the car yet. You cannot die. You can never die. See, I can never die. I'm good. What? On tonight's episode of Clowny on Jason. Don't let them. Oh, I want to kill him first now. He shot he's me. Been, he's been running a lot. Huh? He's been running a lot. He shot me twice. I see you. You going in the house? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Do a knife yet? Do your worst, son of a bitch. Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> I kept. I kept. I, the the head. I, I wanted to knock his head off. Should have done the door kill. That's not a bad one. Where'd he go? Is that him? Use your vision. I am killing you first. Whether that is the right call or not. I feel good. Unless he comes back as Sonic. I don't give a fuck. They're by the car. Yep. Don't stop, Jason. They deserve the to die. Make them suffer like we did. Oh, they have pass. No. Well, get your priority straight. Oh, I'm listen. He's out the window already. Listen, I'm I'm on it. Hello. How you oh, doing? Has he been running a lot? Yeah. Hello. Oh, you've been running a lot, friend. Sorry, friendo. You get the axe to the face. Look at this one. Oh, I love this one. <laughs> Goodbye. Yes! Goodbye, friendo. Yeah. There we go. All right. Where is your other friendo That's now? My oh, hello. That's my special. Boy. I see what you have there. Hi. It's going well, Jack. This is going well. I'm feeling pretty good about this shit. This is one of my favorite kills just because when he does lop off her head, he just seems like he's bored with it. I'm like, I'm Well, I should give him that kill. That's my special, oh, really? special boy. Wait, she ran by the phone, the other one. Oh, shit. This is easier kill in that house, though. Maybe you can get a quick kill on him. Oh. Too late. Hey. God damn it, I hate when you... Yeah, I know. Definitely don't want them to get that phone working. Oh, come, no! come on. Get your shit together, Jason. That was, that was an unfortunate rock is what that, that was. That's exactly what that was. She planned that, Jack. She planned that. No. That's the radio. Come, huh? That's the radio. Tommy's standing right there. He wasted his oh, shot. Oh, he's a dumbass. She wasted her shot. Well. Wow. It was, a, it was worth a try. <laughs> Not really. All right. Are you still in here? 
I can just open this one. Oh, mad trap strats. I didn't see it. You never see it coming. You should, though, right? As Jason. Hi. You get a head punch off. Hello. Chat saying they saw it. Yeah. They saw what? <laughs> they coming. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can hit me with a stick, but I can't hit Jason with a bat. <laughs> Son of a bitch. You can never die. Turn off the old music. Hi. He wants to play. Get up, Jason. You know how to block in combat stance? Uh, Go into combat stance and it's right bumper. Yeah. Let's do it. He wants to play. Break his fucking weapon and grab his ass. Carry a big ass stick. Somebody, okay. Oh. Oh. Uh, there. I kill you twice. Dick. That's my oh. Jason. That's Shit. my special. I'm stuck. Special I'm stuck. I, yeah, I know. I, I just want to show everyone that I cannot move. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. She's probably over here. Len Flaxinski says Lego Batman. Logan, Guardians, Wonder Woman, Spider-Man. All superhero movies have been quality, and we have Thor to look forward to. What we have Thor to look forward to. What are your favorite Marvel movies? I love Winter Soldier and Guardians 2. Uh, something to be said for the Iron Man films. What? She ran up and hit you. There's three there's still three people alive, Rich. Yeah, I know. Nobody's nobody. You're you're not used to people uh, not abandoning. Yeah, I didn't know there were so many people in here. Fuck. Are you still in here? They want to hurt you. Second trap strat. God damn it. Get by the car. Yeah. I turn the music off already. Got Hello. It. I'm gonna throw you on the ground. <gasps> Throw you on the ground! No. Goodbye. Hello, you're next. Spider-Man was great. Homecoming. The Winter Soldier's good. The Iron Man films are good. Fond yeah. of Spider-Man Homecoming. Guardians 2 is great. Uh, I'm going to throw you on the ground, too. No, there's a lot of good Marvel movies. My uh, favorite? Uh, Iron Man 3 is a perfect they action movie. They deserve to die, Jason. Oh. Make them suffer. Oh, ways away. They're going fast. Are they in a car? No, they're just speedy, motherfucker. Probably overshot them, yeah? Yep. Shit. Oh, oh no, there they are. How about that? Nice. You were all over that. <laughs> Hello! You get a nice axe kill. Yeah, learning, learning like, relative distance on the map is a really tough thing. Yeah. Yeah. Don't Boom. Stop, Jason. Eight out of eight, motherfucker! That was great, Jack. That was great. I felt really good about that. Yeah, and I got trapped twice. I mean, that's a little embarrassing. Because, you know, the mad trap strats is kind of my thing. But, hey, eight out of eight. Uh, Iron Man 3 is a perfect action movie. Winter Soldier. That... Elevator fight in Winter Soldier, like that for the the, yep. the first fight, is worth almost the whole fucking movie. That's a great little fight scene, right? 
I the thing one one thing I love about action movies is when the action represents something in the story. And so, you know, like I've talked about Iron Man 3 a bunch, but like that elevator fight when literally his co-workers start to gang up on him and turn on him and and like that pivot in the story taking place as an action sequence is beautiful. He's he's trapped. He's trapped by his co-workers. It's great. It's fucking great. Um hello. Hello. Civil, yeah, Civil War is all right. Civil War is all right. Hello. That the fight at the end of Civil War is is a it's a spectacle is what it is. That's a great spectacle. Yeah. I wouldn't necessarily call it like it felt tacked on. Yeah. To everything else that was going on in the story. That's the thing. Like, like completely yeah, tacked on. Like there, there was no like greater meaning just beyond like, hey, everybody's gonna fight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where you from? You know. Oh, Canada. It's a great spectacle, though. It's a great fight. And Spider Man, he's doing his thing. It, it, it oh, needed nice. to stay smaller scale because the the whole thing that movie's about is you know what happened in the end. Of course, of course. It's all between those just so just those three characters. Yep. Wh which, by the way. That and, and here's the problem: that fight between the three of them is gorgeous, but everyone is so fatigued after the big battle that no one remembers that awesome Cap versus Iron Man versus mm -hmm. uh, Winter Soldier fight, which is great. It's small, it's personal, it's dirty. That and you know what you know what they have in, in that fight sequence. They literally have the Winter Soldier ripping Tony's heart out. Stay. Want to talk about metaf metaphor? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. With the, the thing. He's, he I never really thought he's about it. Ripping his heart out, Rich. <laughs> Sorry. Somebody's saying smaller scale. We'll wait till Infinity War. These are you? two different things. I'm saying for the story they were telling in Civil War. Yeah wasn't about it at the end of that movie it wasn't about the epic heroes all fighting it was all about tony and iron man and having a, a and and captain america having a falling out right over thing it wasn't about the epic st shit that was that felt tacked on in that case and for that particular story yeah the big well, it was out of place well no and like i said it actually diminishes the important fight like the story fight at the end that the big spectacle diminishes, even though it's a great fight, like you know, it's the airport fight sequence. And they're they're not going to do Infinity War right. They might surprise me, but if they do, <laughs> if they do, yeah, that that won't have the spectacle superhero fight in the same way, unless it's horribly one sided, and Thanos just stomps everybody because he is effectively God. I could see that. Here's right? here's the thing about uh, the in, in Infinity Gauntlet. Yeah. It's a story about a, a, a man who just can't get this woman to love him, despite doing all of these amazing, <laughs> grand things. No matter what he does, uh -huh. death rejects Thanos. And what here's you know why you know why I like Thanos as a character. Hmm. He's effectively God, in that story. Okay. He could force her to love him if he wanted to. He legitimately loves death and wants her to love him for who he is. Aww. And she just doesn't. And despite his godly power, he can't force her. It's 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 beautiful. <laughs> You're selling me. You're selling me. If they do it right. Right. And it's just going to be, the one's blown up, the heroes are going to explosions. The heroes are going to explosions? <laughs> what? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> At least two of them are going to explosion. There's a, great. There's a there's a fight in the Infinity Gauntlet. Thanos humiliate basically just humiliates the heroes. He toys with them. I could see that happening in the They movie. they literally stand no chance of winning yeah. the fight. I could see that I could see that happening. That could be a, a really fun second act turn. Is just them losing horribly. Or at the, you know what? That could be that could be an opening fight. Just the heroes losing horribly. That could be fun. Who's where? Oh, is there someone by the boat? What do we got on the boat? Shit! Oh, fuck! Someone's leaving in the boat! <sighs> walkie check, walkie check. Just found the fuse. Nice. 
God damn. Anyone know where the they phone is? Yeah, there's just one of them. I think. Jason's no. coming! Uh, there might be two of them in there. Well, shit. The villains humiliating the heroes who don't stand a chance until the blue beam goes off has been done lots of times. Yeah, but in all of these movies, the heroes eventually succeed. That's that's not quite how the inf infinity goes. It's a bit more nuanced than that. It's not... It, Thanos isn't defeated by the good guys punching him enough. Hmm, let me think about it. Oh... Uh, sorry about that. Yeah, that thing's really hard to aim. Always has like an arc or a curve. How do they beat Thanos? That's the thing. The Infinity War and it, 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 Infinity Gauntlet. I'm sorry, I, I, I'm confusing on my own head now because they're calling the upcoming thing Infinity War, right? Right. Uh, the ending is a bit muddled. I don't think that Starlin really knew how to end it properly. It, it goes on for about, like, an issue longer than it should have. Oh, no. Well, that's an... Ad oh, hello. Fuse box. That's an Adam Warlock thing, right? Yeah, kind of. What happens in the book is, at that point, Thanos subconsciously lets himself get... Uh, he subconsciously lets Nebula take the gauntlet from him because he doesn't believe he is worthy at that point. Okay. And then how do we stop Nebula? It becomes like the last issue too. And it, 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 it doesn't end solidly. Sure. The infinity gauntlet. Uh, I just like that, that core story idea of this person. Who, he, he loves death so much. He, he gets the power of a God okay. just so he can be with her. And sure. he does, you want, you want half the universe dead here. It's done. It, it, he, 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 he does, Everything in his godly power to win her over, and she just doesn't love him. Press T for me. The fuse box is in the tool shed. Yeah, I think that's neat. Like that's that's a that's a neat idea. I don't, you know, like I I don't much care for for space, you know, godly spacemen, but that could be a, a nice way to make it at least relatable. I want to be your friend, dude. Get get off of me. <laughs> like, a lot of what the heroes do in Infinity Gauntlet is they're just dealing with, like, the fallout from what's going on. Oh, yeah? Like, Thanos gets angry, and, and just because he gets dude, angry, get like, that me, causes, man. like, an earthquake to happen on Earth. California falls into the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> the heroes are dealing with that. Sure, sure. Oh, yeah, you need to seriously back up. Does anyone anyone have car keys? <laughs> okay, the car has gas and a battery. Son of a bitch. No fuse either. California falls into the ocean? I'm all on board with that. I get it. They don't like the people. Oh, oh there's, there's, there's the scene where Thanos just slaughters all of the heroes in the most horrific ways possible. That's my outfit. What are you on the floor? Oh, wrench. Wrench. Mr. Plum. <gasps> oh, oh, fuse. Is that like like in the battle in the Infinity oh, Gauntlet comic it? book, Spider Man literally gets decapitated. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's great. He literally gets decapitated. Mm -hmm. Cyclops gets suffocated. <laughs> Thor gets turned into glass and then shattered. 
Nice. I got the fuse. I can contribute. Right. You don't think that the, the Infinity Gauntlet would go over well with mainstream audience? Yeah, I know. That's why I'm not looking forward to the Infinity War movies. Yeah, they're gonna they're yeah, gonna do I know. something different. I'm well aware. Well, and they they kind of have to, just to make it make sense. Well, they did Spider Man, right? They did, oh, well, but Spider Man's like Spider Man's a character thing. I guess. Well, I guess Thanos could be too. So it's just a big we'll see, man. Who's doing it? Well, Russo brothers are doing it, right? I don't know. Oh, she can't repair worse shit, though. So we're gonna I'm going to be quiet for this. That's some shit timing, Jack. You didn't even do anything to alert him, did you? Nope. You just got, got the police. fucked. Bitch. Whoa, who are you calling a bitch? Who are you calling a bitch? Shoot. There. You're the bitch now. <laughs> Ooh, man, I'll grab. Oh, there you go. Well, this is alive, huh? That's yeah, some other people. Please, no! Oh, fuck. Wait, where's my. Oh, I used my pocket knife to disarm the trap. Ah, gosh darn it. Dang, dang, heck a dang, man. Heck a dang. He, he was just over here checking. Like, he doesn't get notified if I disarm his trap, right? Or does he? Unless he was close enough to hear the, the, the clack? I don't know. Ah! One, two... Just two of them left. Dang it! <clears throat> Doctor Strange was a little forgettable. Yeah! Yeah. Yeah. Be friends, please. No. I wanna kill you. Yeah, Doctor Strange was another one where they kind of... They kind of glossed over a lot of the, the fun Help character me. stuff. I feel like they did the same thing with Ant-Man. You know, we didn't get we didn't get an interesting character with either Ant Man or Doctor Strange. You haven't seen Doctor Strange? Yet. No, it's not Netflix. Huh. I just don't care enough to watch it. Right, right. And, just, and by the way, care. I can't disagree with you. <laughs> they they really those movies felt like they were painting by numbers. Yeah, they're still good. Like, and Doctor Strange has really neat <gasps> visuals and one of the most satisfying endings. He uses his smarts and his wits to defeat the bad guy, and it's great. Mm -hmm. Really, really satisfying ending to Doctor Strange, but but a lot of it just feels like paint by numbers hero journey stuff. So Ant Man's visuals are better though. Yeah, yeah, Ant Man has really good visuals, and any excuse for um, Paul Rudd to act in a major Hollywood movie, I will accept. I love Paul Rudd. So if Ant-Man has to exist as a paint-by-numbers blockbuster so Paul Rudd can star in a blockbuster movie, I'm going to be absolutely okay with that. Okay. Is what I'm going to say, because Paul Rudd's wonderful. Find my dead body. Oh, it's right around here, right? Your dead body? Yeah, my dead body has the fuse on it. No, it's not. Yeah. Oh, him. You're, I, I thought... Never mind. I was talking Never to him. I was talking to him, telling him to find my dead body. I'm like, I, I thought I, I wasn't paying much attention. I thought you were playing, and I'm like, wait oh. a minute, you can't, you can't be looking for your dead body because you're not Tommy. This has to be a new game. <laughs> the Jack forget he said, oh, he's just spectating. I get it now. Yeah. Should have had the common decency to die near the phone. It might be in the fuse. No, it's not in. The, well, oh, because I was repairing it. Yeah. Mm, maybe. Maybe. Uh, is shit. Wet Hot American Summer any is good? Yes, it's brilliant. Body? Wet Hot American Summer is brilliant. It is a it is a setup to be a classic summer camp boner comedy, like a like a, a Porky's, like a, a teen sex boner comedy, and it uh, slowly <laughs> eats itself, and it's brilliant. You, also, you might not be into that style of humor, so you might not think it's brilliant. Uh, what had American Summer? Yeah, I saw it ages ago. I remember liking it. It's very funny. So it's very funny. 
But I could totally see somebody not getting their style of humor. Okay. So. Okay. Summer boner comedy. It's boner jams. Anonymous says, Hey, Rich. Big Tums Pharma was touted as the cure-all to stomach pain until recently a bacteria, H. pylori, that burrows in your stomach was discovered. The Tums Festival can end with some antibiotics. They, they discover that a bacteria causes all heartburn. Maybe. Or maybe some. In, in any case, we, we, we don't want to abuse antibiotics. That's true. That's true. Because that's how you get antibacterial resistant strains mm -hmm. that 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 can ruin medical science as we know it. Oh, they can, can literally ruin, ruin medical way. science as we know it. Yep. Once the act, once once you can't use antibacterial medication to cure bacterial infections, we are all fucked. Mm -hmm. That's true. That's so very true, Rich. If a chalk tablet can do the same thing, I'll take the chalk tablet. That's fair. That's fair. If it, and if it works, you know, if it works for you, then you, you just do what works. Don't abuse antibiotics if you're watching this. It's it's deadly serious. Not just for you, for all of humanity. When you, when you have a virus, don't bug your doctor to prescribe you an antibiotic. If your doctor does prescribe you for antibiotics for something, and he tells you to finish them. Finish them. Because if you half acid, that just means the bacteria that like survive the antibiotics that you've been taking better. Yeah. And you don't because you didn't kill them all, those are the ones that are going to reproduce. Yes, the strong ones. This it's seems, serious. This seems to be a, a, a passion plea from you. Cause it's a big fucking deal. It is? It's I a big agree. fucking deal. I agree, it's a big fucking deal. A world without antibiotics working is a world where a lot of people fucking die from oh. from things that are so easily treatable now. I don't think people understand like how good we have at having antibiotics. Like, you know, there was this whole thing called the Black Plague that killed half of Europe. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, it's a big deal. But <laughs> I like that shy guy site says, but on the other hand, <laughs> yeah, I think we need a we need a more we need a more uh, balanced approach to this, Rich, a centrist, you know, about antibiotic resistance. <laughs> He's not in the mood. He's not in the mood for my joking about antibiotics, and that's fine. Next, next, you're gonna tell me that vaccines cause autism. I think we just need to look at both ends, <laughs> which is ridiculous. That's a ridiculous statement, meant to be ridiculously purposeful, purposefully ridiculous. Obviously, there is nothing linking vaccines to autism, and vaccines are helpful because you know polio is not a thing anymore, which I'm really happy about. Like there was, there was a time in this world where getting a cut on your thumb was potentially deadly. That's true. That's true. Oh, he got the gangrene. We gotta cut your. There's thumb. nothing we can do. We, we gotta, gotta cut your we thumb gotta, off. gotta cut your thumb off. Yep. Maybe most of your hand just to be safe. Yep. And if the doctor wasn't any good, they'd have to do the whole arm like a week later. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there is still oh. polio, but it's nothing that, you know, hey everybody has to worry about like they used to. Hey polio still exists, but you know, I was never I was never afraid of getting polio growing up like kids in the 1920s were. Great ghost stories to tell, especially of like of this one of a horrible movie called uh, Friday the Don't 13th. forget to bring the wieners. Oh, they're doing a bit. Oh, do yeah. I got the wieners and the marshmallows and the oh, chocolate they're... and everything, man. Don't worry about crackers. it. You got the graham crackers? Fuck, okay. I forgot the graham crackers! Oh, dude. Don't it's worry, I brought hurt. some. Fuck yeah. See? Come on, See? Get no come on, just load up. already. I'm done with this bit. I don't now I want to kill some people. Have fun, everyone. Have fun. Yeah, everyone. 1984 have a, probably won't be just. Have a good game. Uh, I you can't. Know, we were telling stories at this lodge, right? And then suddenly this guy nope. just came out of nowhere. Not me. Oh my god. I guess I'll just quit. Uh, no! 
I went. Uh, there, there was a moment in the review, in our, in our review of Friday the Thirteenth, in which Rich mentions My the dickhead, who, the away? dickheads, who leave uh, if they're not Jason, because they're Jason only players. And at the start of uh, some matches, you'll just see, you know, X How person do do left. And I started looking through. Oh shit! Ooh, the found a gun. Fuse is here. On the couch. Yeah, like on the couch. this is a shitty map. Yep. Uh, For this exact clusterfuck reason. These boxes either near uh, here So you know, Rich Rich mentions uh, the people who leave, oh, the and so I start looking side. through footage, yeah. like oh, yeah, to, just to try to find that moment in the cutscene. Yeah, I guess he's here already. Of course, Jason's here already. Where people leave, and I uh, I had to go oh, as far as the here. second clip I ever recorded. Yeah. To find a clip of someone like yeah, and I'm uh, shocked you had to go that far back. Uh, only because the first clip I didn't hit record for the open, open oh, cutscene. Oh, okay. So the first face. scene that I had a cutscene in was a he scene I could use to show someone leaving because they weren't it. Oh. Wow, you just broke right through that. Jesus Christ. Hurt, hurt, right hurt my feelings. You hurt my feelings. That's coming, buddy. Hello. I know he's coming for me. Can I do the jukes? Oh. I'll check the drawer. Oh. Can't. No! What? I went in the door! <laughs> oh. You could have saved me! Sorry. Fuck you, chat! Time that yep. gotten the keys. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, lucky motherfucker. Oh, he's going back up. Oh, I already checked these two down. Bye. Okay, great. There we go. Vanessa Powers, activate! Ooh, right? Uh, power of run your ass away! Ooh, you almost had me. Oh, fuck. Ooh, fuck. That was tense. Why? Why are you after me? Good work, Jack. Huh? Good work, Jack. Yeah, that was fucking good, uh, except for Vanessa Powers of getting scared really easily just popped up. It's gotta be a trade-off, Jack. I know, I know. <laughs> Should've perked her to balance it out. Uh, oh, what did I, I give I her? Got you. Jump off. Yeah, I think I gave her some stealth. Uh, no, no. Oh, no. You know what? I gave her a really. I gave her the. Uh, if Jason lets go of you, you get a stamina boost mm -hmm. for extra runaway power. Yeah. All right, all right. And, and I. Oh, I gave her a, a big chance of Jason not seeing you if you are in a house, which is a perk I really like. The house doesn't glow bright red sometimes. Yeah. I got one. I got one. Oh shit! Wrong fucking wrong button. They got they got a car started already, or a car half started. Uh, oh, there we go, there we go. That was actually not a throw. Best of luck. Thanos says oh, the still next two Avengers still... movies were originally called Infinity Wars Part oh, One and Two, sake. but recently they made a big deal about changing it. Maybe so they wouldn't spoil that they're losing at the end of one. Psh. I don't know. They can call it what they want. We know what it is. Crane Hand Christ says, My last tip of the night. Mew guys are grain. Cheap up the good twerk. <laughs> Excellent typo joke. You know she can't. Yeah. yeah, it looks like you did a good job in here. Just double checking your work. Oh God. Don't mind me. Showered help. I want you to help them. Wow. Who are they? I don't know. Where are they? They're probably in the house next to you. I'm going to try to hit you. What's going on with the car? Come on, man. One, one chance. One fuck chance. that. Abandon this guy. Go to the fucking car. No, car. The four-seater. Oh, yeah. Look, they're <laughs> heading towards it. <laughs> they're running towards the car. Vanessa! I have a bat. I can help. I have a bat. Gotham deserves, but not the one it needs. You! Yeah, I came back. You could have fucking saved me, but you chose to let me die. 
You're a traitor. What were we supposed? Hold on. Yeah. What were we what? supposed to do? You. <laughs> you were just supposed. To Dickhead! I didn't have a bat. And just... Oh, that's the two-seater. The four. Oh, well, maybe there's keys around here. What's the two-seater have going for it? Nothing. Just the battery. That's something. That's something. And the other one has Don't poo-poo battery. battery. I'm, I'm poo-pooing the battery. Unless there's gas hanging around here. I'm poo-pooing. You the see a trap battery. down there? Huh? Do you see a trap down there? Do you see Jason around here? I'm just saying. It's a, it's a suitable plan B. Oh, sure. Wait, there was a drawer in that middle hallway you missed. I thought it was open. I don't know. Oh, all right. Oops, someone else missed it, too. That means, that means whoever I'm following here ain't that good a searcher. Yep. Yep. All right. All right, we got this. That's fine. What Friday the Thirteenth movie are we watching? Uh, -oh. uh, uh part six, because that's the Jason we're up against right now. Oh, they might be putting the. Uh... <gasps> Not doing anything right now. Oh, because oh, Jason's there. I wonder if they're running away with a gas can. I would I would assume they are. That would make a ton of sense. Uh, if they're going for the two-seater, they probably have keys. Keep an eye on that. That whole situation, Jack. They're up there. You wait till they die. That's my plan. And hope Jason doesn't notice you, but he probably knows you're there. I mean, I would assume. Basically, if she dies, I just know to go over there and look. Oh, other people are heading towards the other car. They probably have the keys. How many? Ah, just one. But they're they're beelining. Yep. Fuck. They're not. They're not coming back for you, Jack. You're fucked. Wait, no. Jason's probably headed towards them. Find that girl. Get out with this car if you can. Hold on, I can help. I can help. I can help. All right. Yeah, they got stopped. You have a chance. Yeah. You have a chance. Yeah. Yeah, I can help. I can help. You can steal a seed. Yep. No, it's a four seater. They have they have extra room. Hey, uh, say something cool. Oh, like everything you I say goes in ear, one ear and out the other. Shit, is that a dead is that body? Mr. Dunn. Time to get out of here. Go. Nice. <laughs> was that one guy too? Who got killed? <laughs> <laughs> Good, even you, better. You took a seat. <laughs> He's gonna hit you. Oh no no! That was a good. That was a good call by the driver. Oh, does that do any good? No, there's. He threw it at that person. <laughs> Who wants to come and join our team? You got to knock Jason down if you want to get in the car. <laughs> slow down, slow down, Chad. Tell me if you want me to hit T. Oh. And he, see, he seems to know what he's I, doing. I hate escaping with the car on this map. Oh! Oh, that was a classic juke! Sorry, lady! We'll think of you forever! Oh! oh, oh good Jason. Good Jason. Oh, fuck. No, no. This guy knew what he was doing. Oh, good job. Nice work. I think that was Jason saying good job. I was reiterating it because oh. it, it was. I'm just going to hang out here in the back seat. I don't think I accomplished much this time. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Sometimes it happens. What are you doing? Is he waiting for other people to get a chance? I think he is. Wait, wait. Wait. Oh, he's dropping his items. Yeah. All right. I'm down. Don't leave, fucking leave without me. 
You're a class act. Oh, sorry, say that again. I did. No, I was moving. You're a real class act. I'm not kidding. Stay in the car. No. Oh! Come on, Chad! Oh! Sorry. The, you know, the driver has to stay in the car to restart. Everyone else worries about Jason. The driver's number one priority is to restart the car. Oh, now Chad's dead, too. Look at this. Bye, Chad. Dead. He dropped his pocket knife, too. Yep. What were you thinking, Chad? We that were second, out. That second time he got out of the car, what was that about? What was that about? I don't know. He was going. He was going for the... Oh, fucking Chad. Look at that. Look at that fuck. We were out. Of course, I didn't do anything. Well, I hit Jason a couple times, but... Really, if I were smarter... Hindsight being 2020, Rich. Have just gotten in the car. I should have driven. I should have gotten in the car. Yeah, yeah. And just, I, and I would tell you, like, Chad, I'm leaving. If you want to come with, you get in the car now. But I, you know what, I wasn't <laughs> thinking. Chad seemed to be doing the nice thing. Jason didn't seem to be coming for yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. No, and I didn't, you're right. I didn't do anything to contribute to me escaping. I should have, though. As soon as Chad got out, I should have gotten in and driven out. I should have known that Chad would fuck it up. Chad. Oh. Well, I think that's a fine Mommy. place to end it. It's <laughs> a fine place to end it. Hold on, that's <laughs> Chad, your kindness killed us. You 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 good-hearted fuck. I think he said my bad. Killed him with kindness. Yep. Alright. Cancel. Cancel. Great. Hey. Uh, we got up in tips? Uh, yeah. Great. Then this is the point in the stream in which we thank everybody who has come to the stream. Um, and so thank you. And this is also the point in which we thank everyone who has subscribed to us, more importantly, during this particular stream. Uh, much like Edgar Allen Hopo, who has subscribed to us for exactly one Year and Edgar Allan Hopo says there's no better way to celebrate one year of support than with some Nazi killing. Damn, boo, boo, boo. damn straight. Shop mm, shop. Hmm. Meisner one for thirty fucking months in a row. Meisner says thirty today. There's a great Gatsby joke in there somewhere, but really, who gives a shit? Yeah, nobody. Yeah, no. Nobody. Contramundus for 22 fucking months in a row says more Nazi shooting. Ich bin lieber. Mein Leben. Darth Thurv, who says, have you ever thought about playing the newish High Moon Transformers game? The first has co-op. Thanks for the fun streams. Eh. Uh, yeah, we well, you know we, we did that other eh. one. The, uh, the Platinum Transformers game. That was kind of like a meh. I'm not... I'm not that big on the Transformers franchise. Yeah, neither am I. Bleach Mead. Nameless. Humanoid. Frodo 
Nice. For 17 months in a row, says 17 is a prime number. Sure. Gino Suave, who says, LOL, stab my dog. Don Buckwald says, <laughs> three months on the books, but three years off the record. Hope to still be watching and supporting you guys long into the future. Thank you. Thank you, Don. Thank you. Skost Buster. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Grizzly Baron. The real Veon for 20 fucking months in a row. Real Van says, now that you're giving me a proper fucking, I think I deserve some answers. Not, why aren't you playing my favorite game? Not, what animal would Rich be? But the answer to the question we're all asking, when is the next Plinket review coming out? Well, you know, I know we said that it was probably a half in the bag happening tonight. But check your inboxes tomorrow. A little, keep that under your hat. Check your inboxes tomorrow. That, then. that running joke is so old. It's been so long since that's come up. Yeah. You're going to actually anger some people. Good. Good. That that old running joke because it's not true. New the, Plinker review tomorrow. He's talked about doing one. I don't know how much work he's done. He's talked about it. Wow. He works slowly on him. Well, yeah. Because he got, he's got to do them right. Yeah, of course. I've, I've heard some things. I've heard some things. I've heard some things. Hard tree Fokker! An unqualified bard says, if Prereq is looking for a guy in the chair, let me know. By the way, have either of you seen Baby Driver? Fucking beautiful. I have not. I have not. I wouldn't mind seeing it. Humberto Cabbage Patch for 30 fucking months in a row says, Die Nazi Scum! <laughs> Big Fat Man, 873 for 16 months in a row. Doobie Sandwich says, I've been tasked to raise a young French bulldog while its owner is on an extended vacation. I'm constantly afraid that he will somehow leave the house and get me in trouble. He's quite the rowdy pup. Will I remain a good dog sitter by next month? Uh, I don't know. We don't know what kind of person you are, Doobie Sandwich. Genghis Borg 9 for 32 fucking months in a row. Potent Potables 1. Herogen 6 says, when in Rome or hardly working? <laughs> nice. As, oh, sorry. A slight buzzing says, love y'all's character voices. LOL, Phoenix, my rights. It's been a while. It's been a while. Renjib! Bungadug for 34 fucking months in a row! Says, hey, hey, he he, I give prereq my money. I watch lots of streams, but for one I will. Wa oh, I get it. I watch a lot of streams, but for one I will watch a little more. Hey, hey, he, he, I give prereq my money. I haven't actually ever watched the Hey, Hey, PP song. You've never? I've never. I didn't no. I didn't see any need to, quite frankly. No, no you, I mean, it's a stupid little song. Kick Girl V for 15 months in a row says, Here's to 15 months with you wonderful hack frauds. Lots of love to both of you. Thank you. Goose Fistery. Weserit. Nathism. Nathism. Ooh, that's better. Nathism. Euler's number for 12 months in a row. Plonalmani, 45. And Plonalmani says, three months of watching this schlock, you fucks. Biffopotamus for 37 motherfucking months in a row. Crooked Spiral says, thanks for being the best thing on Twitch. Here's some many more awesome streams. Microfiber Militia for 33 <laughs> fucking months in a row. That's just, that's a whole Jay lot. Waited. Huh? It's real, Jay Waited. That's so great. Does that mean, oh wait, 
Jay waited for the stream to end. Oh, it, oh it's happening right now. <laughs> the half in the bag is out right now. Let us get done with thanking you all. Then go watch it. Beginning to end. Weckless for 33 fucking months in a row says, Watching you guys play Friday the 13th is so cathartic and fun for some reason. Keep up the good work and keep having fun doing it. Much respect. Yes, because it's actually a really fun game, despite the fact that a lot of people keep saying it isn't. It's a very fun game. I don't know where people are getting this. A lot of bugs. A lot of bugs. Really fun. A lot of bugs. A lot of technical problems. Yeah, really fun. Yes, admitted. But it's still fun. Despite. Yeah. Okay. This is a great name. Evil Rosa Parks. <laughs> That's not bad. I love... I just like the idea. Of an evil Rosa Parks. Of an Parks. alternate universe an Rosa evil, Parks. evil twin. Right? Yeah. <laughs> well, what did she do that was evil? Like, I'm, I'm trying to think of like something that would that would hurt the cause. <laughs> instead of instead of getting out of... It's, instead of staying in her seat, she would like put like knives under the seat. She, she, <laughs> she like... Pl pl so white, white people would stab down and they'd get like a knife up their right. butt. She would like plant marijuana on protesters. Like. <laughs> <laughs> so she was indiscriminate in her evil things. Oh she yeah, would do. everything. Kick babies. <laughs> just eat, she just just kind of a bitch. Like. <laughs> she refused to get out of her seat, not because she was making a point, just because right. she was being a bitch. <gasps> what if Rosa Parks was the evil Rosa Parks? <laughs> But she didn't know we had segregation on this earth. She she wouldn't she wouldn't get out of her seat for like a handicapped person who needed the seat by the door. Exactly. She, <laughs> she suddenly got transported to our earth, gets on a bus, and was told to leave the seat. And she's like, "Fuck you, <laughs> my seat." She didn't even understand that she was part of the civil rights movement. That's glorious. I love it. Cocaine moon. El Scorcho uh, 4965. That's a nice subtle rolled R. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. El Scorcho. Budget Messiah for 14 months in a row. Uh, 007 Rules. A Horrible Glory slash S for 32 fucking months in a row. Says, Remember when the star of Killing American Style was also driving the Jeep and hard ticket to Hawaii? No one does. No one. I'll have to check that out. Oh. Well, there you go. The e ethereal. Sorry. The yeah. ethereal walrus. Think about that. Okay. Ethereal walrus. T. Carza T. Carlisle! Four for 21 fucking months in a row. Says, haven't been able to watch as much as I'd like, but always willing to support you guys. El Polo Diablo, we know how to pronounce your name. It's it's, it's just hard to remember it. We we know how to pronounce it. Also, your name, El Polo Diablo, doesn't have any fun roles. El Polo Diablo. El Polo like, Diablo. You don't have any roles that I can do. El Polo Diablo? What are we saying wrong? El Polo Diablo. El Polo Diablo. Or is it Palo? If we're pronouncing it wrong, then it's got to be Palo. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Oh. El Palo Diablo. El Pollo? Is it? Ooh, maybe it's El, El Pollo. El Pollo Diablo. All right, there you go. I said it right. Maybe. Maybe. Fuck off. Poi. Oh, yeah. Horrible Glory says Poi O. Oh, okay. Okay. Rich, Rich figured it out. I, I saw somebody in the chat say Poi O. Oh, okay. I didn't figure anything out. Oh, shit. I'm nothing without you guys. It's true. I'm it's nothing really without true. people like... Tricky Ed <laughs> and Guardian X99 Jump Lust Joy Boy for 15 months in a row. Who says hi, Jack? Protect my balls. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that was almost as good as Evil Rosa Parks. R. Miller. No, it doesn't work with the and word. And R. Miller. Oh, and R. Miller for 23 fucking months in a row. And R. Miller says, now subscribing solely for Modern Medicine Lectures by Professor Richard Edlund Evans. This is, this is, important, this is an important bit. That's it's a, it's a serious business. That's a, I'm just surprised at how serious you made it. I don't know. I, I got no bit. Enjoy half in the bag. Go watch half in the bag. Bye. Do? I was what doing the press? end. Oh, I hit the end. You hit. The no, end. I was doing the end. The you hit the mute. 